and welcome my beautiful friend here with Max l'italiano and today we are going to prepare the pastry cream we start this recipe with 500 milliliters of whole milk and the next ingredient is the vanilla pod make sure you use vanilla pod and not vanilla essence because the result is completely different we put the vanilla pod on the table and with the back of your knife you are gonna just flat it. With the tip of your knife we are gonna cut all along the length. In this way it will be much easier to take out all the seeds. And again with the back side of your knife we are gonna take all the seeds out. And the next ingredient is the lemon zest and make sure you don't use the white side of the lemon zest because that is really bitter and is going to add to your recipe extra bitterness. And a medium low heat we go. And now while our milk, lemon zest and vanilla beans are warming up I'm going to prepare the egg mix into the bowl 130 grams of granulated sugar and here we have cornstarch so what I have to do I have to sift it if I don't want to have a lumpy pastry cream so our milk is almost ready as you can see so what we are gonna do now we are gonna simply mix the yolk into the dry mix and the next step consists of adding a small quantity of milk into the egg mix doing so you won't shock the eggs and you won't have a scramble egg but before doing that I'm gonna remove all the lemon zest Now we turn on the stove again, medium low heat, and we put in it. So now what you have to do, you have to simply keep mixing the custard until it gets hard. Don't overcook it, this is not made with flour and you don't need it. And now the next step consists of cooling down the pastry cream below 50 degrees Celsius. So your pastry cream, it won't keep cooking and you will have a really soft and smooth pastry cream. A beautiful result in the end and shiny, that is really important as well. And what we do next, we are gonna place it in the fridge to chill for three, four, five hours. If you wanna have, if you need actually, like in one hour time, what you can do, you can spread it on a tray and cover with clean film. So in that way, the castle will be really thin and will chill really, really fast. In this way, you can just remove the whisk, put the clean film on it and place it in the fridge. When it's completely cold, you will feel it when it's ready and you can use it. And guys, before to taste this beautiful cup of pastry cream, I want to let you know that next week I'm going to upload a video where I'm going to show you five ideas of desserts which are made with different ingredients and with pastry cream. So we are going to put together different things and we are going to create five ideas what a nice idea actually and now I want to give a suggestion to all the viewers who 
by mistake make a lumpy custard. So how you can fix it? It's gonna be really simple. If you have a stick blender or if you have a simple blender, you can blend it, but before you place it in the fridge. So as soon as you cool it down into the bowl, if you see that there is some lump in it, simple, you just blend it and, you, and then you put it in the fridge. And now guys, it's the best time because you are gonna try it and see how it tastes. For sure it tastes delicious guys, but let's try. Guys, it's delicious. Now it's really soft because it was left outside, but if you leave it in the fridge, it's gonna be perfectly enough hard to be workable and you know, to, to create different things. Guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to subscribe, like it, and I'll see you next week with the five ideas that uh, I'm gonna show you.